Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. It's another beautiful day here in Washington State. It really is. It's like 75 and sunny out, and I'm going to go get on a lake later on. But until then, I wanted to come on here and talk at you a little bit. I have some things coming up, some things coming down the pipeline that are quite exciting, and uh, I wanted to bring you uh, up to date on some of those things. So, we're going to do that, but first I want to go through it's in my pockets what I'm carrying today. Um, it is July 20th, and it's about 3 p.m. I just got home, and uh, yeah, let me just show you what I had in my pockets all day. First off, we're going to start with the knives. Why not? Yeah, uh, a pair of three for a folder. This has been getting it done. Um, yeah, I really dig this thing. It's great this time of year because it's pretty light, pretty compact. I can wear it with shorts. I can carry it with shorts, rather. Um, yeah, uh, I dig it. The steel's great. Uh, I, ha I just put a fresh edge on it and finished it at 600 grit um, with my WorkSharp Precision Adjust. This thing right here. Yeah. Finished it at 600. See if that'll show up. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Next up is a fixed blade. Uh, almost dropped that. CRKT Hunt and Fish. A really handsome fixed blade, in my opinion. G10 8CR13 MOV. <laughs> But uh, it still cuts. It's got this interesting jimping on the top. Useful jimping, but uh, interesting. Yeah, I like this knife as a little EDC fixed blade. Yeah, it, it almost ticks all the boxes for me. If it had a better steel, man, I'd be in heaven, but uh, it doesn't. So, anyways, I gotta put a fresh edge on that thing. Uh, you breathe on it wrong and. <laughs> And the edge goes to shit. So, yeah. All right. Uh, next up, multi-tool. Uh, Leatherman Free T4. This thing has been used and abused. And I love it. I absolutely love almost everything about it. Pocket clip is cheap and chintzy. Um, and the blade had a shit edge on it when I got it. Those are my two complaints. Other than that, it's a good tool. Alright, some things I always carry in my pockets. You've seen it before, you might see it again. A couple little coins. My key bar from Hawk Hobbies. Thanks, bud. Moving on to the watch. This is a uh, fishing watch. Gives me the moon, phase, date, time, and temperature. Next up, something that is... Uh, Something that is a little experimental, uh, I'm still sort of working with it, testing it, um, and that is my wallet. My wallet is changing. Um, the old girl is finally given out. Uh, I don't think she has any life left in her, so we're moving on to something new. And I have this bifold um, that I have had. Uh, for quite some time now and it's just been kind of waiting to be used it's decent leather it's not as good of leather as um, that other one but yeah it's a little bit thicker than the other wallet but not by much and um, this thing is still really stiff it's yet to get worn in um, phone Galaxy A51 same old phone I've had takes pictures does Instagram good enough and, uh, yeah, I think that does it. Keys are the Mustang keys, because I was driving the Mustang today. It's a beautiful day. Thought I'd let her out. And, uh, yeah, that, that does it for the, uh, the old pocket dump. All right, next order of business is we got a trip coming up. Woo! We got a trip coming up. Man, finally. Uh, this is long overdue, but I'm headed out east. Eastern Washington to
to visit my old buddy Mike. Um, yeah, it's it's been about a year, I think, since I've seen him. And uh, yeah, it's time to head out there. So here on August 15th, middle August, I'll be headed out there for probably close to 10 days. So yeah, that's something to look forward to. I'm going to be uh, doing daily vlogs, and it'll be interesting. Uh, yeah, it should be a good time. I'm really looking forward to it. All right, that being said, I think that's that's all I really wanted to update you guys on. The channel's doing great. As good as a channel can do in the middle of summer. Um, yeah. I had always heard that summer was the hardest time for, you know, YouTube views and stuff like that. It's, damn, the struggle's real. Struggle is real. Um, yeah, it, it is, but anyways, uh, yeah, that'll do it for today. Thanks for the continued support of the channel for those of you that are watching. Um, <laughs> I do appreciate it. I really do. And, uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next one probably be on the water. Um, like I said, I'm going to try to get out this evening. Alright. See you in the next one.